Hi, KOG, Korean American old guy here. Uh, trying to cover Bicho, Girl of the Year music video. Now, I pronounced it Bicha, which sounds, which I think is more logical. But anyway, uh, the reason I'm doing this is because I had no idea what this group uh, team is or nothing. I was just about to end the day, and I and I just you know I just saw this uh, JYP girl group debut, which I haven't heard of. This is news to me, and I looked and I was going, they look different. I don't know, it just caught my eye. So I, I did a little research, and uh, you know it's VCHA, but it's Picho, which means like uh, shine a light on something that's her name and this is interesting this is a american group produced by jyp uh, i think it's republic records of, in, in the states so i think it's kind of like niju um it's a japanese girl group uh which is a you know fully japanese uh, group produced uh, by jyp which uh, is very, very popular. Now, um, so here we go. I just had to, you know, check it out. I think A2K or something, uh, they had this uh, audition competition, th competition thing. Uh, and th these are the winners, I, th I, I guess. So here we go. Is she Korean? It looks a little bit Korean, but then I I, I wouldn't know. <laughs> Okay, so far, vocals, the ladies have very, a uh, little bit different timbre, uh, different voices come together. It sounds great. Uh, I think the vocals are pretty darn good. And, and the stylistically, it's more, a little more, I don't know, twice-like kind of feel to it. Um, but what's interesting is, I think... I think uh, I think that it's their intent, but um, you know what they're wearing, where they are, and they're practicing for you know. The first impression I got was kind of like a, a K-pop uh, cover dance group, and because I, I guess I have seen a lot of K-pop cover dancers, and you know. I, I don't know if it's the race thing, you know, because they're so multicultural or no, just I think it's just the, the general feel of it, what they're wearing, uh, you know, just uh, and maybe intentionally they look slightly green, which they are. And um, yeah, like fresh kind of vibe. But another thing, also another thing, uh, maybe I'm talking too much, but you know, these are American group, but perhaps intentionally the the, the song, uh, the stage, what they're wearing, 
uh, the beat, it reminds you of a more, little more traditional K-pop, like maybe second gen or early third gen type of a feel. So the song is very little more older K-pop, you know, more K-pop-y, K-pop, K-pop, K-pop thing. And, and ladies, are, they seem really young. You know, they have a, like a really, and they, they look so nice. They look like really uh, awesome. This is so like old K-pop. Old setup. I want to thank myself. I want to thank myself for the way that I turned it up. I never let me down. Not that easy. Ripping up the motor. I'm burning it. I can't get enough. They look so, so nice. Now I'm feeling so free. Baby, tonight, like a dream. Oh, I bet you never thought you'd see. Girls of the year. Yeah, that's sweet. Something that you never thought would be. Feel like girls of the year. Dynamite. Look at the year tonight. Girls of the year. And back to a uh, little green, you know, cover dance type of a thing. I think maybe that is, uh, it's, it's intentional, I think, because, uh, you know, it's like uh, uh, girls dreaming of, the whole song is about, you know, girls dreaming of that being a star and, and actually making it, you know, that nobody thought that they could, but they, they're making it. I think that's the whole song is about. But again, this is, uh, and I think it's a great idea. Uh, this is their debut song, so it's perfect uh, because they are Americans. They look American. Um, uh, it's just mannerism. And, and the thing is, we are used to uh, hip hop idols being like they might have multiple or some. Um, foreign members, but they have that certain look, and and they're you know they're few and far between. But this is totally American group, so it might be like a little jarring for uh, uh, average viewers to go, you know, accept them as they are. But uh, here, by putting them in a very k poppy stuff, uh, that it's you know. It's easier to accept them as uh, because end of the day, who cares, K-pop, J-pop, whatever. If it's a good music and if it's well produced and good singers, hey, good great song. Uh, that's what makes it. Anyway, um, one thing though, I think this was just great. Uh, uh, well, but just one thing just bothered me. I just thought. The vocals and the instrumentals kind of was kind of a little uh, distant. It, it didn't feel like it, it mashed really well. Uh, is it just me? Uh, if you, if you are one of those uh, you know audiophiles with the uh, all this understanding of uh, producing and stuff, please tell me because it just felt like uh, vo voices were a little muffled. These ladies had beautiful voices. Uh, they each had a very different color, uh, vocal color, and 
and it, it wasn't hard hitting. It wasn't up front. It, it felt like it was uh, pulled back a little bit. Uh, that's, you know, I thought it would be a little better if it was, I just felt like it was just muffled a little bit uh, for some reason. Oh, one more thing. I hope there's more of these guys, especially in the States. I hope they make it big in the States. Because there's just... Okay. Wholesome is... I don't think everything has to be wholesome. You know, racy, whatever, tough, gangster. You need every, you know, especially music, you need every kind. But there seems to be total, very few. They lack, uh, like, very talented, well produced, but very wholesome, non threatening group in the United States for whatever reason. And they need more of this, man. Because, you know, look how wholesome they are and they're young and they got dreams and it just we also need this in the industry we we can't we can't have people who are i don't know like <laughs> saying obscenities and i don't know just pissing on people i mean you know what i'm saying it just this is cool i i hope they do really well i i i guess uh i'm gonna be uh looking forward uh to what they do next Anyway, see you guys next time.